It's Nat and Essie plus Sprinkles the Bear. <laughs> Hello, hello, besties. Essie here for Nat and Essie. And today, look what I got. I have one, two, and three bags of clear stuff. That's right. I went shopping because I have not been to Claire's in such a long time. And I went there yesterday and my mind was just blown away by the amount of cute items that are in there. And I cannot help myself, so I decided to do a haul for you guys if you love Claire's and you love all cute stuff make sure to subscribe to this channel and like this video you know the drill blah 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 so let's go ahead and get started let's take everything out of the bags Whoa! Let's check them out one by one. Here is our first item. It's our beaded super shimmery unicorn stationery. So we have our ears here. We have our unicorn horn, the hair that has different colors. Oh, look at those lashes. And then we have this little pouch on the front with a little stationery inside. And then here is how the bag looks like. It's a beautiful color of purple, pink, and a little bit of blue. So let's check out this little stationery right over here. Whoa, how adorbs! We have our pages here that don't have lines. I love it. And then we can always put it right back inside like so and then if we open up this one we have lots of blank pages as well so that is our first item but the second item is actually something that I bought to match my first item and that is ta -da! our unicorn water container See how they're matchy-matchy? They're perfect for each other! It has ears, it has the unicorn horn, and these are kind of um, rubbery material. But the only thing is with this one, when I brought it home, look what I found! It's chipped! Mm, not only that, the other side here is also damaged. So I was so excited to buy it because it matches my stationery here that I did not even um, care to inspect it. But when I got home, I was like, oh no! But other than that, I think these two are a perfect match. Here's another one. This is our pastel colored pen holder. I love the little circles inside, all pastel in color. And then here is how the inside looks like. I think this is super duper cute. And because we have a pen holder, uh, obviously, we need some pens, right? So here is um, the one that I got. This is a little puppy with really long ears and glittery eyes, as you can see. It has pink bows, of course. And here is the pen. I love the silver shimmery thing going on there. So let's go ahead and put that in our pen holder just like so and then here we have a set of super cool pens this one says be kind and the other one says love more here they are also pastel in colors and i think it will be perfect to put in our pen holder because i feel like they match let's click it and make sure they work oh yeah they do and now let's put it in our pen holder just like that. And then uh, look at what we have over here. We have two sets of super cute erasers. I mean, why would you want some, you know, um, basic square shaped erasers when you can have one that's shaped as doggies like these <laughs> with different colors. And then look over here. We have one that are unicorns and llama llama. Although they're super cute that now I don't know if I even want to use them to erase some things because then, you know, they're going to get all crooked and stuff. 
notebook time. So this one I got because of the colors. I love that it's super vibrant and it says good vibes because, you know, no negative vibes going over here. Um, the material of the cover is plastic, but it's thick plastic, so I think it's uh, pretty durable. And then if you open it up, we have our pages that are actually lined. So this is great for a journal or, I don't know, everything really. So that is that. And then we have another cutesy patootie notebook over here. This one is fuzzy and that's why I got it. I keep on thinking what kind of animal this is. I'm like, is it a puppy? Is it a fox? No? What do you guys think? I think it's a fox because of the color. I don't know. Mm, I might be wrong. It cannot be a cat. No, definitely not a cat because it does not have whiskers. But it can be a puppy too. I don't know. Or a squirrel. Ah! Help me out. Let me know in the comment section. But it is adorable because it is very fuzzy. It has this glittery beaded um, bow. Look at all the lashes in the glittery nose. And then we have the arms over here, which I thought I can like take out, but I don't think I can. What is, what is it for? Is it just a style? I don't wanna mess it up. And then <laughs> over here we have a lock. So I guess you can use it as a diary because you can lock it and keep the key away from everyone. Here is how the back looks like. Very, very cute. Speaking of fuzzy, I have another fuzzy thing going on here. This one is a little keychain or backpack clip, if you may. Okay, this one is a unicorn. I see the unicorn horn, the uh, colorful hair, glittery ears, lashes, and here is how the back looks like. We have our little key ring right there and the clip. Can we open it up? Yeah, we can. There we go. And you can put something inside. Not a whole lot, but I have a rainbow corn here that's also a unicorn, you know? And I think you can actually fit that inside. There we go. Next up, we have this little container that you can also hang onto your backpack or purse. And it has the letter J here that has lots of jewels. It's totally glammed up. And I thought this was actually a sanitizer container because, you know, we use sanitizers all the time. But I just realized now that this one is actually a hand lotion container. And that's okay because we do use hand lotions quite often. And my name is Essie, but my niece is actually January. So it starts with letter J. So I think I'm going to give this one to her. And then we have another letter here. It's letter M this time. Again, it's not letter E for Essie because I think I am actually going to give this to my sister. Her name is Melody and she loves pearl and pink and fuzzy things. So this is a little kilted mini backpack that you can also use as a um, backpack clip or purse clip or a keychain, I guess. It actually has a good space inside to put quite a lot of things. And then we have our little um, fuzzy ball. And then look at this one. <laughs> this is like a three-in-one item. A little backpack container, a little pom-pom, and a little squishy. Come on out, little squishy. And of course, it is a pink unicorn design. And we can squish it. <laughs> Oh, so cute. Ah, whoa. Another letter J over here. This time, it's not only glittery. It also has some little shimmery stuff inside. I see stars. I see lots of different shapes. And I love that it kind of jiggles a little bit. So whenever you're moving, it will kind of move. So that's fun. And then we have a little pink pom-pom right here. And check this out. It also comes with this two little lip items. So we have a pink lip gloss that's also shimmery and a clear one. 
I actually really like this one because it's lightweight, so it's not gonna weigh on your bag as heavily as the other keychains that we got. I have another mini backpack over here. I feel like this is such a trend. So we have two now. We have this pink one, and then we have this one that is not only a mini backpack, I love the tie-dye print. As you know, tie-dye is all the rage these days, and this one is no exception. So it has a little pocket on the front that you can definitely use. And then we have a bigger pocket right here, which is the main compartment. So yeah, you can have a mini backpack onto your bigger backpack. Or you can even use it as a wallet, I would think. And then uh, there is also this rainbow colored rubbery thing that you can use, I think, like a coin little purse, I would say. So, um,. Here is how the inside looks like. It's very roomy. You can put lots of coins in there. Love the rainbow design. Oh, and check this one out. This one is $5, as you can see by the tag over there. And uh, this one, I think, is like a paper holder. Let's try it out and see what it really does. So you can use it as a um, card holder. You can use it as a mail holder. Yes! Or a paper holder on that regard. And here is the final item. I saved the best for last. At least it's the best for me. So in the comment section, I want to know which one of the items that I got and showed you guys is your favorite. My favorite one is definitely this one. It is this Panda Baba Milk Tea Phone Case. I mean, pandas. Who does not like pandas? And I love me some baba milk tea. I love, love, love it. I think it's a super fun way to style your phone case and, you know, tell everyone how awesome pandas are and baba milk teas are. Okie dokie dokes everyone, these are everything that we got. I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, we will be doing more Claire's hauls in the future, so make sure to subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you again in our next episode. Essie here, bye!